You should never use Wikipedia as a source for academic writing. However, sometimes it can be very helpful to use it just to find some information and then it could lead you to places that are actually good academic sources. This is going to be a brief overview on how to correctly use Wikipedia for academic purposes. So let's go ahead and look up a subject. I'm going to look up digital literacy. And it will take me to a page that summarizes the basics about digital literacy. Wikipedia is great if you need a general overview of any subject and you don't know too much information about it previously. Now the gold for Wikipedia articles is down towards the bottom. You scroll down, you'll find the references list. And some of these will be really good academic references, but you can't really tell just by looking at them. So what you want to do is copy the reference. Here we have a James Inman article. And then go over to Google Scholar and see if it's in Google Scholar. If it is, you're going to get more background on where that reference came from, what journal was it published in, and you can better check the article to make sure that it is a legitimate academic reference. Now, Google Scholar doesn't have everything, but it has a lot. So this is just one easy, quick way to make sure you're using a quality reference. If it's not showing up in Google article, I would recommend steering clear of that. Now, advanced academic researchers, they have a little bit more leeway. But you, as a beginning student, just take this advice. Stay away from it if it's not showing up in Google Scholar. So definitely use Wikipedia to get a brief overview, but never quote it directly. Use those references down at the bottom and look them up in Google Scholar to determine where they come from and if they're good sources or not. Thanks.